In this video, you'll discover the step-by-step -step guide to getting your real estate license in Alaska. We will also share with you the secrets to selecting a real estate school and revealing the best real estate company to get started with. So make sure you watch the entire video. This video is brought to you by Digital Agent Show. Visit digitalagentshow.com guide for a free guide to getting your real estate license in 66 days or less. There are six steps involved in getting your real estate license in Alaska. However, before explaining them, let's go over the criteria you must meet before getting the license. You must be 19 years or older, have high school diploma or GED, have a crime or felony free record. The first step is to finish a 40 hour pre-licensing course. The real estate course will cover topics like property ownership and land use regulations, real estate agency laws and fiduciary relationships, property valuation tactics, financing options, mortgages, property transfers, real estate practices and disclosures, and contracts. Step 2. Once you have completed the required hours, you must pass the course final at 70% or higher. Real estate courses are designed to provide you with the principles and practices required to sell real estate in Alaska. The course will not teach you how to sell real estate. That is up to the real estate company that you select to teach you. That is why at the end of this video, we will reveal to you how to apply with the best company to get started with. So stay tuned. Your objective for the real estate class is to learn the information presented well enough to pass the course final exam at a 70% or higher score on a multiple choice test. Step 3. You need to pass the state or national exams at 70% or higher. This exam is proctored by Pearson View. Step 4 is finding a sponsoring broker. Not all companies are alike, and some are better than others at working with new agents. Even if you don't stick around to the end of this video to find out which company is the best, you should make sure that you do your due diligence when selecting a real estate company. Step 5 involves completing the application for the real estate license. This involves submitting all the required details and information. However, you must finish the application within six months of passing your final exam. Step 6. Complete 30 hours of post-licensing training within 12 months. We've already covered a lot of information, and you might have more questions. Not a problem. Our free guide will show you how to complete all of these steps and get your license in 66 days or less. The link to request this guide is located below this video in the description. Now, how do you select a real estate school? Let me show you the secret to selecting a real estate class and real estate school. Our experience is that there has been a significant difference in the pass rate for the state national exam based upon the course format over the past few years. The exam is administered in a computerized, multiple choice format. The online courses better prepare you as a student in the same format that the exam is delivered. This is particularly true for those students that invest in an online program that includes an exam prep module, like those offered by the CE Shop. Some students also ensure their success by investing in the prep agent system. The description to this video includes links to both of these tools. The online version allows prospective agents to get up and running sooner than those that have to wait for a classroom setting and then have to add on study time for the state national exam. The online format, pluses, flexibility and study time. Anytime you can log on to the internet, you can be studying, usually is a less expensive investment for the course than the classroom or video-based or the self-study book study format because you're not having to pay for the facilities, instructor, or textbooks. If you have a high comprehension and retention level when you read, you could be done with the course in a matter of days, as long as you pass the course final exam. The practice exams are in the computerized format that the final exam and state national exam will be delivered. Minuses. Because there is no set schedule, a student in this format may have difficulty in focusing and time blocking to finish the course. Remember, no matter the course format, each requires a final exam. The classroom setting format. Pluses. Usually taught by an experienced instructor that is able to answer any questions that you have. Classroom setting allows for interaction with fellow students. The instructor may be able to provide some tips on passing the ultimate state and national test. Minuses. Time. The course is usually taught in a chapter format that is spread over multiple weeks. Lack of flexibility in scheduling. Classes are at a set time and attendance is mandatory. Those same fellow students that you are interacting with may not be as committed to succeeding as you are, and this may prove to be a distraction. Bottom line. 
this is an area that will require you to make a decision based upon your own commitment, study habits, and past course experience. Do you need someone to hold your hand in a classroom setting, or the safety net of an instructor you can turn to, or are you disciplined enough to block off the time to take the course? and study on your schedule via an online environment, the pluses for an online course far outweigh the minuses, and you will be better prepared for passing the classroom and state exams. We have included some links to real estate courses that you can get started on right away. The sooner you get started, the closer you will be to the freedom and flexibility that you desire for yourself and your career. Selecting a real estate company. The first real estate company you join after getting your license will set the tone for the rest of your career. The right company will guide you through the basics as you learn the ropes. The wrong company will leave you wondering whether you made the right career choice. Your first agency can influence your career as an agent, so it has to be the best one for you. Make a list of some real estate companies of your choice and do some research to find out the answer to these questions. Do they provide any training to rookie agents? How is the company culture? What is the commission split structure? How much do new agents have to pay as fees? What facilities and support agents get from the company? How is the reputation of the company in the market? Our guide to getting your license in 66 days or less includes a section that answers all of these questions regarding real estate companies and then some. You can find a link to request the guide down below. We also have a link that will allow you to schedule an interview with the top real estate company in your area that offers a plethora of training, an award-winning culture, best in the industry 100% commission-based split plan, and new agent support. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the Digital Agent Show channel for more information on how to get started in real estate and be a successful agent.